Hello friends, myself R.D. Mahajan presenting my video on Z-transform solution of difference equation by Z-transform technique. Uh, this is example number 5th. Uh, already I have discussed 4 examples. I will provide the link of that previous videos in the description box. Please watch that 4 videos. Uh, here the given difference equation is f of k plus 2 minus 3 f of k plus 1 plus 2 times f of k is equal to capital U of k by Z transform with the condition uh, f of minus 1 is equal to 0, f of 0 is equal to 0, f of 1 is equal to 0, u of minus 1 is 0, u of 0 is equal to 1 and u of k is 0 for uh, positive values of k. Uh, using this information or using this condition we try to solve this problem and therefore the given difference equation is for taking z transform we get a uh, z transform of left hand side z transform of right hand side individual z transform of left hand side term that is z transform of f of k plus 2 then minus 3 times z transform of f of k plus 1 plus 2 times z transform of f of k and that is equals to z transform of u of k and then applying standard result of z transform of f of k plus 2 as per that standard result it is z square f bar of z minus z square f of 0 and minus z f of 1. Uh, this is the standard result of uh, z transform of f of k plus 2. Uh, remember this step. This step is very very important. Uh, there should not be any uh, single mistake while performing this step. And then next uh, z transform of f of k plus 1 as per standard result it is z f bar of z minus z f of 0 plus 2 times z transform of f of k is f bar of z and that is equals to uh, z transform of uh, unit impulse function as values exist for negative as well as positive we use this standard definition k is equal to minus infinity to plus infinity u of k into z raised to minus k as per the definition and substitute the values of f of 0 f of 1 in left hand side uh, value of f of 0 is 0 therefore this term becomes 0 we have z square f bar of z uh, this one is 0 uh, f of 1 is also 0 therefore this term also becomes 0 therefore both this term become 0 minus 3z f bar of z again f of 0 is 0 and plus 2 times f bar of z and that is equals to we split this summation as first summation is from k is equals to minus infinity to minus 1 plus for k is equals to 0 and then next summation for k greater than 0 that is 1 to infinity. Uh, first of all I will write u of k into z raised to minus k everywhere. Uh, here also u of k into z raised to minus k and here also u of k into z s to minus k and then I will substitute the value uh, here f bar of z there are three terms of f bar of z uh, combining it therefore if we combine it by taking f bar of z common we have the terms z square minus 3z plus 2 into f bar of z that is equals to u of k is also 0 for k less than 0 
and therefore uh, this term becomes zero. For k equal to zero, we have u of zero into z s to zero. U of k for positive values, again it is zero. Therefore, that term becomes zero. Means we have what is the value of u of zero as per the given condition? It is one, and therefore that term becomes one. Z uh, s to zero, we get one. Therefore, on right hand side we have a term of one, and then dividing by this z square minus three z plus two, we have f bar of z is equals to one divided by z square minus three z plus two. A quadratic equation. Uh, we try to find out the factors of this such a way that the product is two and sum is minus three. And therefore, the factors are z minus two and z minus one. Product of minus two into minus one is plus two, and sum of that minus two and minus one is minus three. Therefore, these factors are correct factors. Uh, we call this as equation one. Uh, here, the first half part is completed, where we have to obtain the z transform of that given difference equation next step is we require to find inverse z transform of equation 1 inverse of this and going to apply that inverse by inverse of z transform by uh, inversion technique as uh, there are two poles z is equal to 1 and z is equal to 2 that two poles lies within that contour uh, equation number 1 is a bar of z is equal to 1 upon z minus 2 into z minus 1. Obtaining the pole by equating these two terms to 0, we get z is equal to 2 and z is equal to 1 as simple pole. To obtain that inverse by inversion method, we have to multiply this equation by z raised to n minus 1 or z raised to k minus 1. Therefore, multiplying by z raised to k minus 1 on both sides, we get z raised to k minus 1 whole divided by z minus 2 and z minus 1. And we call this an equation 2. And then uh, we, uh, we require to find out the residue at the first pole and residue at the second pole. Therefore, residue at first pole z is equal to 2 is equal to z minus a is a 2 therefore z minus 2 multiplied by this term it is z s to k minus 1 divided by z minus 2 into z minus 1 at z is equal to 2 uh, this z minus 2 and z minus 2 get cancelled and then substituting the value of z as 2 in the remaining terms we get 2 raised to k minus 1 divided by 2 minus 1 as 1. Uh, equation number 3. Uh, this is the first residue. Residue at the first pole, z is equal to 2. Then we try to find out residue at pole, z is equal to 1. This time, formula becomes z minus a is here 1 multiplied by this term it is z s to k minus 1 divided by z minus 2 z minus 1 at z is equal to 1 this z minus 1 z minus 1 get cancelled and then substituting the value of z as 1 we get uh, 1 raised to k minus 1 divided by 1 minus 2 we get minus 1 and therefore any power raised to 1 a 1 raised to any power we get that value as 1 and therefore this is 1 upon minus 1 we get that value as minus 1 equation number next 4 a solution of that given difference equation is obtained by taking a sum of these two residues 
residue at the first pole and residue at the second pole and therefore we get f of n is equals to 2 raised to k minus 1 and this minus 1 as the solution of that a difference equation. Therefore, so far I have discussed total 5 problems including this a uh, fifth one. Therefore, watch that all 5 videos and if you have any doubt regarding that how we can obtain that solution of difference equation by the transform, write your difficulty in the comment box. Please like my video, share it as well as uh, subscribe to my channel and to receive the notification, please press the bell icon. Thank you. Thanks for watching.